let's look at how the ADSR envelopes are operating in SynthMaster. So you have four ADSRs right here. ADSR number one is always all automatically connected to your main voice right here, which is going to control the volume of your oscillators. The way this works is we have an attack, decay, sustain, and release. Attack is how long it takes for the sound to go from uh, its lowest moment, or no volume at all, to full volume. Decay is how long it takes to go down to the sustain volume. Sustain vo volume or sustain level is how loud it is as you're holding the note out. And then release time is how long it takes for the note to release after you let go. So here's a very slow attack time. I'll adjust the attack slope as well. Here's a very fast attack time. How about the release? Let's make the release very long with a nice slope. And then sustain how long you're holding it out for, or the volume you're holding it out at. And then decay is how long it takes to go from its loudest uh, volume all the way down to your sustain volume. That one is all automatically connected to your volume right here. Now if we want to use other ADSRs to modulate other aspects, 